Hey, what is going on everyone? It's Pure Gore, Pure Gore Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you the insane God Mode Goliath glitch that everyone has been doing on Domination, Uplink, and any other game mode that has two rounds within it. So, for this glitch, all you're going to need to do is set up a custom one. So your very first class has to have the Goliath score streak. Now, everything else within that is optional. Like, if you want to use a UAV with extra assist points to help you get it faster, you can use Hardline to help you get it faster. You can use Scavenger. So if you're using a bulleted gun, you don't run out of ammo, and you can use Danger Close. So it's 10% more powerful, I believe. Pretty much what you're going to do, though, is get your Goliath within the first round of that game mode. And after that, you're just going to hold on to it throughout the whole rest of the game mode until the next round. So that's the only downside to this glitch, it only works in half the game, you can only have Goliath God Mode in, but it's such a good glitch, it's totally worth it, just for the 4 minutes that you'll actually have it. So pretty much like I said, all you're going to do is spawn in on the next round with your Goliath, and the second you actually do spawn in, call in that Goliath immediately, don't even go try and capture the objective or anything, that'll take too long, and the second that thing lands, Hold square, the second this yellow bar is completed, you're going to hit options or start, you're going to click change loadout, change it to custom 2, then change it again back to the original class that you had, so custom 1. So in case you didn't catch that, I'll do it one more time. You're going to hold square, the second this yellow bar fills up, and you start getting into your go live, hit start or options, hit change loadout, then hit custom 2, then do it one more time, except custom 1. So you're going to originally be using your custom 1 class that you got the Goliath on originally. And then what you're going to do is get into the Goliath. The second that yellow bar is done and you start actually getting into the Goliath or climbing into it. You're going to hit start, change loadout, custom 2. Hit start one more time, change loadout, custom 1. You will have your gun out. You will look just like a regular player. You can hold square self-destruct like I'm showing you right now. You can just keep on killing people pick up their scav packs or if you have an energy weapon just keep using that but pretty much you're just in complete god mode you cannot be killed whatsoever I think you can lag out the game if you get a full group of people doing it so if you have 6v6 and everyone's holding square I'm almost positive that game's gonna lag out something's gonna happen I'm not even sure it hasn't happened yet to me but it gets pretty laggy just with two people uh, I've been in a match where there's been like three or four people doing this glitch and pretty much what happens is this game will get so lagged up, even if you're not in the glitch, everyone's just going to be lagging, so it's pretty insane. I'd like to thank my good friend Frost for helping me out with this glitch, this way you can see how he looks, just so you know, he looks just like a regular player, he's right in front of me, you can't even tell that he's in this glitch unless you were to like look at the kill cam or shoot him a crap load of times and he just wouldn't die. But rather than that, you could get banned when you're doing this glitch, so I recommend not doing it in a public match, it kind of ruins the game too, for those of you who do want to play legit still. I mean, right now, as of this point, I can't even find a single match that people are playing legit in Domination or Uplink because so many people are doing this glitch right now. But, anyway guys, do it at your own risk. Thank you so much for watching. I'd really appreciate if you drop a quick like on this video. It does help my channel grow. And subscribe for more daily GTA 5 and Call of Duty content. Remember, it's been Piragora, Piragora Gaming here, and I am out. Peace.